Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. For this video, I'm going to be tackling my girls' restroom and also the playroom. I'm going to be doing some cleaning in there, some organizing, and also some decluttering in both the restroom and the playroom. And I like doing this because Christmas is coming up, so I got to declutter some old toys that they don't play with or old hair accessories they no longer use and just have things in order for anything new that comes for Christmas and that way everything has its place already. Please consider subscribing if you haven't already done so. I would love to have you here in my YouTube family and also please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. Even if you try, you wouldn't understand it. Maybe something's missing inside of you. I'm starting off here in the restroom. I'm going to take everything out of the drawers to have a clean slate and to be able to wipe them down also. And I'm just going to also make piles such as headbands, hair ties, and also a pile for the hair accessories that they are no longer going to use. Once the drawers were empty, I just went in with the wet paper towel to remove any loose trash and hair that had accumulated. And then I'm going in with this Mrs. Meyers multi-purpose cleaner and the basil scent and just giving them a good wipe down. Inside all that greatness and all of your adventures. To organize the drawers, I'm going to be using these white containers I got from Target. I got three different sizes for their drawers, but on the top drawer, I'm going to put all their dental cleaning supplies like their toothbrush, toothpaste, toothpicks, all the things like that. And for that, I'll show you in a minute, but I'm using an extra kitchen utensil organizer that I had and I thought that was perfect because it already has different compartments and then in the middle drawer I'm just putting the smaller bows, the hairbrushes, scrunchies, hair clips, water sprays and then on the bottom drawer I end up putting the headbands and also the bigger bows. putting a couple of the thicker headbands on the top drawer and these are the ones they use to get their hair away from their face when they wash up I ended up getting rid of quite a few hair accessories. I got rid of some bowls that were just too small for Stella now and some headbands that were ripped or bowls that were no longer their style. Most of the hair accessories are Stella's, some are Serena's headbands that they use, but for the most part, they were Stella. 
Now I'm gonna go in and just give it a light cleaning because I had already cleaned the bathroom the day before and that's why I realized I had to come in and organize their drawers. I had been putting it off for quite a bit and it just needed, like I said, that decluttering and it looks so much better like that. We can hang out on the beach without free now moving on to the playroom and i like coming in and just getting rid of some toys around christmas time and their birthday just because new toys will be coming in and i don't want to have a buildup of toys that she is no longer into no longer using i like decluttering some and then bringing in the new so this is the perfect time that i like doing it during christmas time Stella shares this playroom with Serena right here. She has her little desk area in the corner where she does her distant learning. So I'm not touching none of her things. I'm just focusing on all the toys and getting this cleaned up and organized. So what I want to do here is I'm going to take out the smaller plastic drawers I have here in the closet. So I'm transferring what I have there into the other plastic drawers because I'm going to take that out and I'm going to be using it to organize Stella's Barbies. Santa's coming to visit No, he wouldn't miss this In Christmas times Oh, and the sun said it is just getting better On a blanket with the skyline painted in blue Ooh. The way I have her toys set up are in plastic bins and then I keep them all in the closet so in the bins I have just different categories of toys one could be all the little figurines like the lols or the shopkins and then another drawer or play food tea party things so I have everything organized like that and then I have it on top of her closet and just whenever she wants to play a certain thing like if she wants barbies i'll get down the barbie drawer or if she wants to play with the tea party stuff i'll take down the tea party stuff but lately she's been more into the barbies so i want to just have the barbies more at hand for her so it can be easier and i thought putting them in this plastic drawers were perfect because it has three drawers and I'm going to use the top one for Barbie furniture, the middle one for Barbie um, clothes and accessories, and then the bottom one for the Barbies itself. That way it's more accessible for her because that is what she plays with the most. And then the other toys, I'm just going to keep them up here in the closet and she'll just ask for them whenever she wants to play with a certain thing and it just helps keep less clutter and it makes less mess there's not a lot of toys out at once and it's been working for us so right now i'm just going to go through the bins and see what she still wants or what she wants to get rid of in the closet, I also have that big black bin and that's where I keep the bigger toys that don't fit in the smaller bins like her dolls and just anything that's bigger and that's where I decluttered the most from was from that one so it looks much emptier now so I might get her a smaller basket to put those bigger toys in. We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Doesn't matter if the snow is falling Or the windows in the rain is pouring It will always be Christmas in my heart But this year I wanna hang out with my friends and family Making angels in the sand you ready Doesn't matter if it's Christmas Great.
I ended up decluttering a bag full of toys. They're all gonna go for a donation. And now I even have some empty bins I could use somewhere else. Now I'm gonna just go in and give it a quick wipe down and clean up. And Gabriel ended up hanging up her canopy here that had fallen from her reading nook area. That is all I have for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you got some motivation to tackle your to-do list or do any decluttering you need around your house. I also want to wish you a very Merry Christmas and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Making our Christmas memories